Friend, do you need to be healed? Do you, do you need financial blessing? Do you need a new job? Do you need your relationship restored? Do you need a new car or a new house? What do you need? Well, I'm here to tell you that the Bible tells us that if two of you, if two of you agree as touching anything, that it will be done for them. And Jesus also said in that same chapter, in Matthew chapter 18, that where two or three of you are gathered together in my name, there am I in the midst of them. You know what that means? That means that if you and I will just agree in prayer right now, and we will, we will reach our hands out to one another and make contact, then guess what's going to happen? God will give us exactly what we ask for. Our healing, our hope, relationships restored, money that you need, whatever you want, the Bible says, He'll do it. Let me ask you a question. How did I do? Did I sound like a televangelist for a moment? Because that's exactly what many of them will do. They take that passage of Scripture, a couple of verses in Matthew, totally take them out of context, and have built entire faith healing ministries and prosperity ministries on that passage of Scripture. Here's the problem. It doesn't mean that at all. In fact, it's got a deeper and more powerful and even more practical meaning than that. And that's what we're going to be talking about this coming Sunday at Community Bible Church at 9.45 a.m. and 11 o'clock a.m. Eastern Standard Time. We're going to be looking at these verses in Matthew chapter 18, specifically where Jesus said, where two or three of you are gathered together in my name, there am I in the midst of them something more powerful than that and more practical. We'll look at it this coming Sunday as I continue my series called Misunderstood. We're looking at some of the most misunderstood ideas about God, about Jesus, and some of the most misunderstood scripture passages. So make sure you join us. If you can't join us at 9.45 or 11 in person, then make sure you join us online for our 11 o'clock a.m. live feed. Now, something else is happening this Sunday. At 1 o'clock, if you're in the area, we are going to be having our beach baptism out on Dania Beach. As a matter of fact, if you're in the area, you're just going to have to get to Dania Beach Boulevard, go out there and follow the signs to Mizell Park. When you get to Mizell Park, you're going to have to pay the entrance fee, but don't worry about it. Have enough to pay the entrance fee. I believe it's around $6. Bring us your receipt. We're going to reimburse you so it costs you nothing to attend. Now, we're not providing food or drink, only water, so make sure you bring a picnic lunch for you and whoever else is with you so that we can enjoy this and sit around. We have several people who are going to follow the Lord in baptism. I've already spoken with them, and it's already planned, so we're excited about what's going to be happening. That's at 1 o'clock this coming Sunday, October the 24th on Dania Beach. But make sure you join us at 9.45 or 11 or for our 11 a.m. live feed because this particular scripture passage is so misunderstood. But once you understand it, it will change how you deal with other people. We'll talk to you about it this Sunday. See you then.